Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the Grand Cat, and today we are going to be proing the Arcane Werewolf Brock Lesnar to see what exactly he is going to look like, so let's just get that underway right now. Both of them are level 100, they both have the 100 matches. We are going to combine. And there we have the animation for Werewolf Brock Lesnar. It's actually a little bit more animated than the vampire one is. That's quite cool to see that the arm moves. Um, so we'll take a look at the. You know what? I'm just going to screenshot this for the um, thumbnail. But we're going to take a look at the the difference or similarities between Lesnar and, of course, our double uh, our pro um, brawn breaker. So you see, there's no actual. Not really any kind of animation. I mean, the wings move a little bit, but it's more the castle with the bats in the background that has the animation. Whereas the werewolf one has got quite a bit more animation. It's very cool to see. Um, as well as this, we also have um, the sea creature, Randy Orton. We don't have a second one of him yet. But in terms of females, we do indeed have a vampire Becky Lynch. And we have a second Becky Lynch in the second that we get enough of the Vampire Fang. We need three more. Then we will be making a pro Vampire Becky Lynch to see what she looks like as well. So in the meantime, let's train up our Brock Lesnar. I think we've got a few things here that we can use. We can uh, get rid of. So we can get rid of these two certainly. And also these two. Brings him up to level 101. So I don't think we want to go getting rid of any of these. Because we want to keep the Summer Slams um, for making the fusions. We also have a Stone Cold that we could change him into something as well. But I'm waiting to get a second one and then see just how many of the Moons, Vampire Fangs or Cursed Gels that we have. Now, we're only two away from getting uh, two more of these, two more uh, resetting the draft boards. And got to use the super move another eight times, and then we'll get the other ones. So that will give us enough Vampire Fangs for the Becky Lynch. And of course, it also gives you a chance at pulling one of these cards as well. So, very cool to see. Um, let's see, just at level 101... Where is Brock Lesnar? So Brock Lesnar is currently stronger than the uh, the pro arcane Undertaker, which is our strongest regular arcane, but he's a little bit weaker than Braun Breaker. But I think that this Brock Lesnar is probably going to surpass Braun Breaker just because Brock Lesnar is a bigger star, and that tends to be what Supercard does with the characters. The bigger the star you are, the more points that you have, um, which you can kind of see it here, like going down the the path of these <laughs> with poor old Eric Bischoff down here at the bottom. I know that Eric Bischoff I think is the weakest of the arcane cards as well. So I'm going to try and pro, well I'm going to try and train up this Brock Lesnar, he's already proed, I'm going to try and get a pro of the Becky Lynch as well. We've only got two arcane females, one is this Asuka and one is this Becky Lynch. So once we get that second vampire Becky Lynch, I think that's probably going to be our strongest female. Our current strongest female is the double heroic SummerSlam BCE Alaya from the last event. And next to that is of course the SummerSlam BCE Alundra Blaze as well. So I think um, Becky Lynch is certainly going to surpass all of that, which should be very, very cool to see. Of course, we've all got Clash at the Castle, Bailey. Uh, speaking of, I don't think I mentioned this in the last video, but in the Superstore, these have updated and you can now get yourself an Extreme Rules Arcane br uh, Bro Mission Matt Riddle, as well as the Arcane Extreme Rules 1916 Finn Balor as well. Personally, I don't think these... Um, uh, you know, the artwork or the anything is anything particularly special. Uh, I'm going to leave these guys. I'm probably going to go for the next one. I'm going to just save it for the next tier. I think the next tier should be Survivor Series. So that should be coming 
um, about the time that Survivor Series comes out in actual WWE. So, that is going to be it for this video, folks. Just a short video. I really hope you all enjoyed. If you did enjoy it, please give us a like, share and subscribe. And if you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification icon so you can see when more of these videos go out. And we will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.